We're not going to even think about it until after Summer's first birthday. But then when we start to think about it, it'll be turning my embryo, my eggs into embryos and considering a surrogate, considering adopting or considering taking our chances. Obviously your birth and delivery plan wasn't exactly as you probably imagined because you did get so sick afterwards. I mean, that had to be really scary. You're dealing with, you know, just having a baby and, you know, postpartum and everything like that. And then it must've been almost impossible, I would imagine. It was really scary. I mean, I didn't even know how bad it was until it was like too late and they're putting, not too late. I mean, they caught it just in time, but they're putting me on a magnesium drip and I just have all of these drugs getting pumped in my body. And then I'm like worried that it's going to affect her. And it was just a lot at once, but the staff, she, the staff at Caesars were really good. They were amazing. They didn't, they didn't, they, we didn't realize what, what uh, danger she was in until after the fact. And then, then, then we kind of looked back and thought about like those moments were like, wait, that's that's where that could have gone. So yeah. it was definitely after the fact, scary to think and then we're blessed after there and so it kind of hurts a conversation like oh, what happens about the next one how do we handle that conversation so i don't know we'll see yeah, yeah. what about the next one <laughs> i mean we're not gonna even think about it until after summer's first birthday but then when we start to think about it it'll be turning my embryo my eggs into embryos and considering a surrogate, considering adopting or considering taking our chances. Obviously because of preclampsia, yeah. doctor said health that syndrome. They, and which it advanced to, yeah. They can go ahead. Now that we're aware of that, they can keep the pressure on it. Like the best thing about all of this is the world we live in with this medical with medical practice right now. It's it's phenomenal around the world. So I mean, not once around the world, but <laughs> definitely here. <laughs> How has having summer changed your relationship? Look, I think having summer, it's definitely made us. It just, it just brings more sense to the meeting, you know. Like doing doing things. Like we go out, we enjoy our time away, but then when we're back home, it kind of it kind of enjoys the little things. Like when we sit there and shoot us, make a sound, or something like that. Look at her, and I just see. So cute. I see my love in my for I see my love in the family. I'm just like. Oh. I mean, yeah. You can't get any better. We're bragging when we start talking about summer. I know. No, I mean, she is just the absolute best. She's a little angel baby. But I mean, I think it's just brought us even closer together and just seeing how amazing he is with her and just how hands on he's been from day one when I was in the hospital and capable of even holding her without a nurse watching me because I got so sick after. And he has just stepped up and been there the entire time. I. I'm sure he's changed more diapers than I have. And uh, I just, I fall more in love with him and I just see how good he is with her. So tell me all about this Homebody app. Yeah, so uh, we've been working on it during the, during the pandemic, our gym shut down and obviously a lot of the, for myself included, we went to online training. And so she and helped me at the beginning of the pandemic. We're doing live workouts on, on Instagram live. We're doing Zoom workouts. Uh, hi, Penny. And during the workouts as we were doing them, um, it just wasn't a, an efficient, clean, like a clean platform. So we wanted to kind of bring a, a creator aspect to have a high quality live class where we could connect yourself um, with some creators or followers that you guys want to go ahead and work out with. So influencers, celebrities that want to host live workouts can go ahead and now schedule those classes on Homebody um, and then go ahead from Homebody and uh, meet meet with them, work out with them and participate on a, on a premium platform. I love that. That's such a good idea. Sheena, has this helped you get back into uh, post baby body shape? Yeah, he's kind of like a drill sergeant when it comes to the gym. But I will say, like pre baby, I had the best abs I've ever had in my life working out with him. It was just something where we needed to find the right balance because it was the only time in our relationship we would fight was that like hour we were working out together. But I will say it was only because he wanted my best interest and he knew what like my um how much i could push myself and so you would just always push me to the limit and just you know wanted the best for me it's but just, i'm like all right i know i can do 10 more i don't want to do 10 more <laughs> but it was just yeah him uh just knowing my potential <laughs> definitely have you felt the pressure to bounce back after baby i mean you look amazing Thank you. Um, definitely in like the beginning of the season, which you'll see a lot of that story play out. I know that you're never supposed to compare yourself to others, but it was very difficult for me and kind of impossible when I have another friend who just had a baby and 
bounce back immediately and she's strutting around in a string bikini and I'm like trying to cover up but still look cute. We have all these theme parties. I'm like 10 days postpartum. So it was definitely a challenge for me, but that is something that by the end of the season, you will see me in a crop top. I'll say that. <laughs> Good for you. That's awesome. That's great.